I found myself a secure place in my workplace to talk about the car where the least amount of noise would be made and chicken and stuff like that, hopefully. But some things I have to cover here. Well, first of all, we're at almost 800 subscribers or 800 subscribers. It depends on when this video comes out and it depends on how much subscribers we have already, which is really awesome. Like, it was just a few basically a month ago we were 700 and we just shoot up from 700 and reach 800 which is really really amazing i actually love that and i'm sorry i'm going into a little bit of our games i do want to feel a little bit of everything else and, you know spice things up a bit i don't want it to get boring or anything and i always play the same game over and over and over and over and over and over and over again that's why I've taken up a little bit of Modern Warfare 3, and that's why I've taken up Need for Speed Underground again, which is really heating up because it's really getting exciting, and I'm really loving it, and I'm really getting used to it. And I basically reached where I was in my young youth days. Can't believe I even reached that far when I was a little kid, which is really cool. Alright, so let's talk about the car first of all we want to talk about the bodywork we have a lot of stuff done with the car but we need to talk about bodywork first for the design i guess so the design i'm not sure if i want to put it any further i am thinking about something but it would take a lot of time and it would change up the old color of the car you guys tell me what you think do you think this is okay the way it is or do you think i can do a little bit of more work on it I will if you choose for me to do a little bit more work on it. I will save this car as, as progress just in case what I am thinking of going the further fails. And I uh, have this nice cool design to fall back on, but basically it does look good right now. It looks good in every aspect. So let's talk about the bodywork. The first one is the front bumper. Why I chose the second one? The second one looks so freaking amazing other than every other else. Every other else looks standard, normal, but this just looks out of the edge. The back bumper says the same. Look at everything else. Everything else does look mundane to me, but the second one looks absolutely ridiculous. The hood, I have two versions to choose from, and who knows, I chose that one. The side skirt, I go with a second to flush everything out. It, I can say it is the best. It is just, it, between three and this, it is really good. The spoiler, there was so much to choose from, but I chose the second one. May not have been the best one. You can change it when you want. This one looked really cool. This one just looks so out of place. That's why I chose it. And this one could work as well. And even look better. Let me see something. Yeah, I'm going with this one. No freaking way. I'm going with this one. This one looks even better, which is really cool. And that's why I'm glad that I even go over these stuff to talk about it with you guys. The suspension, I've dropped it to the ground and you can see the same thing. Camber, I haven't put any on it yet, either track width. I may put track width on it, I'm not sure. It depends on how things go. I didn't put any trap it basically on it because everything lines up perfectly under the front fenders and the back panels back water panels so it's really really good so far the tune that i have on it you guys know about it already it's kind of um in between kind of a race car type tune i'm not sure if i want to push it any further because it really is fast i guess but who knows let's let me let me give you an example of it oh yes if there are some things i should tell you to watch out for is don't do not use nos in the first and second gear Save it for when you reach a third gear and up because those are the gears that are going to need the nice.
I want to go to a to the long stretch. It's the best place to show you guys what I'm talking about. Yeah, and let me show you how much I actually put in the car. That's why I say I may change it because this is a little bit too much for it. So that is basically the reason why it isn't been released yet because I still haven't found the full length in which I want to push this car and I think pushing it up to 354 kilometers per hour is a little bit too much so it's still been worked on so basically the first the second gear is absolutely fine what I need to work on is the third the fourth and the fifth gear I need to find a perfect balance between each and when I find that, it will run perfectly. So it may not come out as fast as possible. I will try to have this video up by Sunday. It's the best day to put it, Sunday or Monday, but mostly Sunday because I'm not gonna buy the new car yet. With it. So the Monday video, if possible, we will talk about the end product of this car. It going up online for you to get in the project car folder on the Mega mega storage thingy and going to get our new car which I think will be the Honda Civic which is really cool it's one of the first cars that I ever got in this game it's the first it's the first car that I've got in this game and it's the first car that I got in underground 2 which brings back a lot of memory that is why I didn't choose it when I started the underground 2 profile and that is why I didn't choose it here i choose it here but you know, you know what i mean again thank you guys so much for making 800 subscribers i hope this progress and it's running goes the same way up to 900 up to 1000 and if we can hit 1000 before the end of march going into april it will be fantastic more videos to come hope you guys enjoy like subscribe share and i will see you guys next time